Okay, me and my cousin, we just got here. We're at San Antonio. We're gonna get us some food. What time is it? Uh, it is 9.25. Okay. We're gonna go in here right there. Yeah. We still like Mexican food in here, so we're gonna get us like some tacos and stuff like that. Okay. And here we gotta make, we gotta, I'm saying gotta make, we gotta fill out our own thing of what we want, so. Like two seconds. I ain't all day. It's nine o'clock, and I'm just now finna eat. Tacos, and I got some rain. I got tacos, and I got chips and queso. Work. Okay, we finna eat, and then I'm gonna bring y'all back when we done eat. Yo, big hungry. <laughs> Oh, it's talking about me, and I'm big, and I'm always eating my food fast. Little lady, you so can't put it away. Okay, y'all, we on the way back. Oh my gosh, my car! We're on the way back to campus. Campus, you finna break in my car or something? We on the way back to campus, and no, are we going to Jenny's? Okay, we we finna go to Jenny's. So we gon' we gonna let y'all know when we get to Jenny's. How many people you shot? I didn't go to jail. What kind of blick you got? My blicky. <laughs> no, 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 no. Look. Blicky. What? Blicky. Nah, for real though. For real though. What sound your gun make? Fuck. Fuck. The gun went in the camera. We didn't see it. <laughs> you can call it go on date night with me and my cousin. Who said I want to be a date? Just kidding. You don't want to be my nature. I can I try the um, lavender. Okay, hold on. We're going to tell them what they taste like. It tastes like a... This is what I imagine a dryer sheet tastes like. A dryer sheet. <laughs> I think I'm good. I just want to come on here and say that I just had like a real life vivid moment type thing like I'm just sitting in a car and I'm just thinking I'm like I want to grow as a person I feel like I need to surround myself around those type of people because if you don't surround yourself around them type of people then you're just not gonna be nothing for real life you can't hang out with like bad people and expect to be whatever, whatever. yeah because I'm bored and I don't want to go back in my room, but I just type. I don't know if y'all do this, but like every time I got something to say, or if like a thought come to my head, or if I got to talk about something, I just go to my notes and I write everything down. Notes is so convenient. Like this is probably the best app they get on this phone because you can literally just put everything in your notes. Literally, like it's like a little journal for me. Anything they got like the little mirror at the top, I just use for notes. I even got like places to go type stuff. I don't know if this every girl, but I want to ask, do y'all have like the little baby names chart? Because I got a whole little list of baby names, but I'm not going to tell y'all my good ones because y'all might try to steal. Got to watch y'all. I'm going to look through my notes. Now we're going to do a video of me looking through my notes. Okay, let's start it. I said, have we ever been able to see stars? I feel like when I was younger, I could, like you could really see this, 
that it was real stars in like the sky like what's that the big dipper type thing like you could really see them stars now if you look up in the sky you don't see no stars that's so weird to me because where is the stars at i'm probably a little conspiracy theorist to something but where is the stars at i know i'm not tripping okay let's see what else we got i wrote down ringing in my right ear because when my ears ring i just like keep dates or tracks on when my ears be ringing <laughs> I have a tally chart of boys that like bobs and boys that don't like bobs. I had a debate at the beginning of the school year on if boys like bobs and like why they don't like bobs or why they do like bobs and I just want to <laughs> I just want to ask people, ask a random amount of people and see what number I come up with. Four hundred dollars spine tag because I was thinking about getting a spine tag. Let's see. Oh, I took these notes on a book I read. I'm not going to read the title, but like, yeah. And basically, I wrote down all the things that the book was like pointing out. I slick might start doing book reviews because reading is fun. Like, it's crazy that people really don't read. But why are you not reading? You need to be reading in books. Pick up a book. Pick up a book. Nurture your brain. Please. I'm going to read a couple things that it say in the book. Well, I'm going to read a couple things this, um, that I took down. You need to go from wanting to change your life to deciding to changing your life. Take decisive actions. In order to truly raise your vibration, you've got to believe that anything you want is available to you. And the best way to keep this bed strong is by staying connected with God. Get you a Bible, honey. Growth is painful. Growth is painful. That's a good one. Growth is painful. Forgive yourself. Love yourself. People's opinions on you are irrelevant. We don't care what other people think. Live your life how you want to live your life. Don't live your life for nobody else. Live it up for you. Eat, sleep, breathe your vision. Surround yourself with people who think the way you want to think. Wanting to be someone else is a waste of the person you are. Tagged Kurt Cobain. Gosh, it's making my hand hurt. I need to get a tripod. You, all caps, you create your own reality. Yes. But we're not going to read all of them. But we're just going to read some. And hopefully y'all go pick up the book because the book is actually a really good book. These are just names I had for my business before I chose the ones that I wanted. So I just like made a list of them in my notes to choose from. Today, I think we're just going to do like a day in a life vlog. Um, I don't really have much planned today. I'm thinking of bleaching my eyebrows because I just feel like the hairstyle that I'm trying to do on Tuesday, I feel like it's all going to come together. I'm just getting a ponytail, but I, I want pigtails, but I want my pigtails to be different. Like, I want, I want my pigtails to be like, you ain't never seen nobody do that before. Or if I get like just one ponytail, then I want like a specific part or I want, I'm going to add some like string glitters into it. Like, or some rhinestones. It's got to be something. I'm trying to come different. Because I feel like I keep seeing the same thing. So I'm going to try to come out with something different. I have a lash appointment tomorrow. So I'm going to add that in here. But I lashes tomorrow. Today I think we're also going to Whole Foods. And I'm going on a picnic date. So I'm going to take y'all to the picnic date. I'm in a study room right now in my school. And I'm supposed to be studying right now. But I kind of got distracted. So I just went and got my camera. If you're not going to do nothing. At least be a little productive. So I was like okay. Well I'm just right here wasting time i might as well just record and make a video so i just want to talk to y'all and see how y'all day going my day going pretty good so far i'm trying to be productive i went to well i attempted to go see my pastor today but the people was in the office what i almost said it was in the office the people that was in the office was telling me that i had to have came at nine and then had like an appointment so i'm just gonna wait till tomorrow morning i'm gonna get up at it nine o'clock tomorrow we really probably need to get up at eight so i can beat the line get up at eight o'clock tomorrow and go up to the office get all my classes registered for next semester and i think i want to do may semester because i just want to go ahead and get college done as soon as possible like i want to get in and out i went ahead and just start raking the money in for real i also did my nails i don't even know if i showed y'all what my nails look like yesterday but I have one broken nail, so like don't talk about my finger. Um, I broke it and I didn't want to put acrylic on top of it because it's not fully healed yet, but it is a little orange because of the polish that I used yesterday and I just never really cleaned it off, so. Um, but I'm gonna try to just 
I'm gonna just do that. So, yes. these are the nails that I did. So, see that? But yeah, these are the nails that I did. Um, my cuticle area is a little dirty. I do know that I was rushing yesterday and I was really tired. If you do your own nails, then you know how exhausting it is. And I was tired and I didn't feel like cleaning around the area. So if you see a little orange crust right there, I know that that's there. And I will clean it up one of these days. I'm just a little tired right now. I'm trying to almond nails because I feel like the square is getting just like a little overrated to me, my opinion. And I want to start doing almond shape because I feel like almond is just like, it's such like classy girl. Or just like... I don't know, like that almond shape, it's just, it just, it's, it's something different and I'm going to start trying something new. So when my gel tips get here, I'm going to apply them. I'm going to try to show y'all how to apply them at home. And yeah, because I feel like the acrylic is really damaging to your nails, especially if you have somebody who doesn't know how to properly apply them and remove them. So, I mean, I do my own nails, so my nails be cool. But besides this, this was my fault. I did, I cracked my nail really, really, really bad, but I'm going to start trying gel X because I want my nails to grow out. My natural nails to grow out longer. And let me show y'all. I got an iPad for like editing and stuff. I need to get a case because I'm very, very, very clumsy. And I like to... I already got it dirty. I'm very clumsy and I tend to drop or crack and damage a lot of my things because of how clumsy I am. So luckily, so far, so good. I'm try to keep it up because I don't have time to break this iPad. This year, I'm trying to do better with drinking water because I feel like I don't drink enough water in a day. So, I got this big jug. It's a, it's only at, I only have it at 11 a.m. right now. And it is currently 4.24. So, I am definitely behind and I need to catch up. So, didn't even barely, barely went down a notch. Barely. Get you one of these so you can stay hydrated. And I also, I got me a cup from Starbucks today. Um, I put my little drink in it. I usually get like the mango dragon drink and then have them blended because I feel like it tastes better like that. So yeah, super good. So we're going to go ahead and leave out. I think the first thing we're going to go do is go to the park or we're going to go, I think we should get the fruit first. So we're going to go to Whole Foods first, get the food, then go to the park so we can set everything up from there. And yeah, so we'll see y'all there. For what I do, gel X. Um, it's supposed to be easier for like curing it faster. Order some gel X tips. I ordered long coffin and I ordered some. Um, I ordered the almond shape because I said I wanted to do some almonds. So, and it, these also, this brand, um, a press, it come in half sizes, so it's like easier it's like really perfectly fitting for your now the tips are actually pretty like supportive they're pretty strong like they thicker than what i thought they would be because when i heard it was like just a tip i would think it would be like a like a false acrylic tip and those would be real thin but these are actually pretty thick they're pretty strong so i got these two and i'm be sure to record when i do my first step because i haven't did jellics before 
But I want to start getting into it, so that's why I ordered it. And then the last thing I just got was the extend gel that came with it. And yeah, that's all. So whenever I do my gel like set, then I'm going to be sure to record it so I can show y'all how to do it. Especially, this is good for like people who like to do their nails at home. It's a lot easier than learning how to do it first because all you have to do is just put the tip on. You don't even have to build it up or anything. So I didn't close out what we were supposed to do yesterday or what we did last time. We was at the park and we had a picnic day. So today we're going to, um, what we got to do, the hair store? Yeah. Today all we're going to do is go to the hair store to get some, um, to get some dye and to get some bleach. And also need to get some stuff for my ponytail tomorrow. So I have a hair appointment tomorrow. I'm supposed to be getting a ponytail, but I want to get like some glitter extensions to go inside the ponytail. And... Today was a very productive day. Today I ended up doing eight assignments. It's a day great. I did eight assignments today for all my classes. And well, not all my classes. I did mainly business work and we're on a roll for this week. This week is what? Today is 522. I plan on going to the gym today. So the the plan for today, not sure if we're gonna complete every day. We're finna go to the hair store. After we get done at the hair store, we're going to, we're going back to the dorm. And when we get back to the dorm, we're supposed to blow dry my hair, blow dry Cindy's hair, bleach her hair, make it brown. After we make it brown, we're going to do her nails. Or we're going to do her nails before. Either one. We're trying to figure out now what we're going to do, what the plan is. And then, after we do, what, after we're done with hair... And it was, it's probably going to be late because what, it's what time? It's 12 o'clock, but I'm still trying to make it to the gym. I'm going to try to make it to the gym. I'm going to try to finish a couple more assignments that I have. Sorry, y'all. It's my cousin Sydney. I think that's all for today that we have to do. So, um, I was supposed to take y'all to my lash appointment, but I didn't end up taking y'all to my lash appointment because when I got to my lash appointment, I left my camera in the car. So, because I left my camera in the car, I didn't get to record it. However... They do look really good. I know my eyebrows need to be done, so don't talk about me. I had her add some stars in there because I thought that was a little razzle-dazzle that I needed. So, yeah.